Okay, get started. I'm Jessica June. I am a fourth grade teacher here at Walton Farm, and today we used Google Classroom to do an integrated language arts and science lesson. Yesterday, my students read an article about camouflage, and I worked a small group of readers. The rest of the class worked independently to annotate that article. Today, they took that article, um, I set up a Google form, and I put in some questions, and they used that article to answer the questions using text evidence and analysis. After they completed that article, it gets submitted to me, and I receive the answers in the form of an Excel document, which which is really helpful because then I can compare their answers and I can pull over children that may need more support or didn't quite get the concept that I was looking for. After they were completed that part, they worked with a partner um, and created a mini Google Slides slideshow. But to communicate, they used Google Hangout, video messenger, or just typing to one another to communicate who was going to do what with the slides so it was fully collaborative. Having one-to-one -one laptops has been really, really awesome. In the past, with a full grade level, each of us have 29 children, we would have to sign out a laptop cart, we would have to coordinate with other grade levels and appropriate times. The one-to-one -one has just made my planning and my teaching so much easier and fluid. The other nice thing about one-to-one -one technology is, and especially Google Classroom, I can really seamlessly build things for leveled learners to use. So for example, if I have students who need enrichment in math, we have several Google Classrooms established. So I have one for language arts, one for science, one for math, and then I actually have one for our start time period. So those students who need that enrichment in math, I can easily plug in some things that I'd like them to work on online. They can either work together or individually um, on these enrichment tasks while the rest of the class is working on curriculum. With regard to my more fragile learners, especially with regard to language arts, they are very proficient on technology use and coupled with the journeys program they can access our small leveled readers so it's very nice that I can work with them in a guided reading circle but then they can go back to their seats access that text online they can highlight they can annotate and the neat thing for me is that I can then see the work that they've done and then they can bring their laptops with them when we meet again and I can then log on and kind of see the things that they've done my students are so proficient already at laptop use. My kids can teach themselves how to do Google Slides. They taught themselves how to set up um, Google Hangouts as a communication method. The kids have really picked up on it. It's a great tool for um, team building and community building, and they really do jump right in to help one another without my prompting. And the fact that I know at 10 years old I'm preparing them for their future is really, really awesome. There you go. That's better. So much better. Whoa, whoa. Hang on.